This video is based on my internet research. It may not be 100% accurate. Hey YouTube family, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Universe Collector. In today's video, we will talk about a beautiful fitness model. People are often amazed to see the beauty of this fitness model. What do you think about this beautiful fitness model? Yeah. Tell us in the comments. Because and if you have come for the first time on the channel and you have not subscribed the channel yet, then press the subscribe button now and also press the bell icon to see more new videos like this. And now we come to the video. Who is Natalie Eva Murray? Natalie Marie Coyley, wrestling name Natalie Eva Marie, is an American actress, model, fashion designer, and a professional wrestler. Popular for her red flowing hair and her on screen antics, Eva joined WWE in 2013 and in a short span of time, she has become one of the most eventful and entertaining WWE Davis. Before that, she had to undergo a two year long training to officially become a part of the WWE roster. She has been an athletic person since her childhood and has some sharp artistic instincts. Apart from wrestling and ring, she has been seen in many advertisements and infomericals and has also made regular appearances on the cover of some coveted magazines such as Lucas and Glamfit. Other than launching her own line of fashion, she has appeared in two video games produced by WWE. She has been part of a cancer awareness initiative for a long time and despite all her achievements on screen and off screen, she remains a grounded person in real life, early life. Eva was born Natalie Marie Nelson in Walnut Creek, California on 19 September 1984 to a Mexican mother and an Italian father. She is the youngest of three children in her family with three elders brother before her. Her family moved to Concord soon after and Eva spent most of her childhood there and gained interest in athletics and soccer while in school. She was raised in Concord, California. She wanted to become a professional soccer player, although her plans were put on hold when she suffered an anchor injury in her senior year of high school in 2002. Eva, who played as a striker, recovered and continued playing at a Diablo Valley College in California where she received her associate degree in art. She received junior college, all-American honors and transferred to Arizona State University. Although a lack of self-confidence led her to stop playing, she transferred to California State University where the soccer coach pursued her to play again. However, her National Collegiate Athletic Association eligibility has expired due to their five-year clock rule. Eva later said that, I would not have run into that problem if I just believe in myself from the start. Now that I am older, I know it's so much better to have tried and maybe you fail than you than to have never tried at all. She graduated with a Bachelor of Arts in Business Management and a minor in Human Resources and moved to Los Angeles to pursue a career in modeling, acting and promotional work. Career. Her modeling assignments got her noticed by the WWE management and she was signed on in 2013 and was sent to Florida for WWE Performance Center for training. Later that year, she was officially brought on board to be a part of WWE and started her career with a reality show called Total Divas, a show which featured some selected divas to give the audience a peek in their behind-the-scenes actions. In the raw episode in July, Eva made her official WWE ring debut and in the debut match accompanied by Natalia, she defeated Naomi. Eva later becoming a wallet of Bray Bella in the ring and accompanied her to several matches and become her tag team partner in SummerSlam success match against Natalia and Maria. She then started a feud with AJ Lee, who happened to mock and insult the show Total Davis. Mary disappeared from WWE for some time, but made a comeback in 2014 on SmackDown and defeated Alicia Fox in the very first single match of her career. After that, she mostly fought in the tag team matches and got busy with her ongoing feud with AJ Lee and Tamina Sanuka and managed to defeat them more than once. 
In April 2014, Mary appeared in WrestleMania, making her debut on the WWE Special Show and their in a WWE Divas Championship Invitation match, but she lost. Mary was then set up to start up a rivalry with AJ Lee once again, the then Divas Champion, and she lost two non-title matches. one in raw and another at smackdown in her very first appearance on next she lost the match and in a gust she returned on wwe main events and ended up winning a non title matches against aj lee she took a break from wwe for some time during the end of the year and confirmed through her instagram account that she was coping with an injury she made her comeback to the ring in the early 2015 and her constant losses got her to receive further training and Brian Kendrick the WWE tag team champion at that time came ahead to train her she made her come back with next where she was severely booed by the audience she defeated Curtis in her next debut and in one of the matches post her feud with another next diva Carmela She ended up a victor. She showed definite improvement in her style and went on to defeat Billy Kay and start eyeing next women's championship. For which she challenged Bailey. Mary lost the match and also her chance to win her first major wrestling title in a January 2016. match for the number 1 contender for the divas championship she lost to carmela mary had her last match on next in a non title shot against the championship asuka to a loss she reappeared in the wwe main roster in march 2016 and secured a minor win in a 10 diva tag team match upon drafting to smackdown her antics kept showing up and she did things to avoid fighting in the ring face to face Presently, Eva has been busy with her outside WWE assignments and said that she will return to WWE once she is settled in her career as an actor for which she has been struggling for a quite some time. Eva Marie has remained a constant favorite of modeling and fitness magazines and apart from being on the cover of several magazines she also featured on the 83 spot in Maxim Hot 100. She has appeared on the Spanish television with the show Twelve of Cora Jones and on her own line of fashion and hair extension services. She made her film debut in 2017 in with the film titled Inconceivable and will soon appear in the film titled Action Number no. One. Other media. Eva appeared in Fitness Blowout in For America in October. She was a part of the Marino Fitness campaign and appeared in the Sketches Americas. She appeared on the Sports Illustrated website as the lovely lady of the day in December 2012 and on several magazines cover including Rucas Importer magazines and Glam Fit magazines. Eva won the 2012 Power Tech medal and several fashion competitions. She had modeled for Red Carpet, Red Chapter Clothing. Eva has appeared on the Spanish dating show. She appeared in Stumper Dating of Maxim magazine. In 2016, Eva launched her own fashion line, Name Fashion, in alignment with its female empowerment and anti-bullying missions. The brand gives back to women in need through her Name Foundation. She then launched Never and Denim, a luxury and size inclusive denim brand in 2017. Eva Marin has appeared in two WWE video games. She made her in-game debut in WWE 2016 and last appeared in WWE 2017. She was also featured in several other WWE related merchandise and received her own Mattel doll, a Funko Pop collective and three action figures. Eva Marin has traveled to Afghanistan, Dubai and Washington DC to meet with US military and their families. and accepted the corporate leadership award at the Soldier Strong annual award on behalf of WWE in November 2015 In 2017, Eva took part of a four-person tournament at the A-League Street Fighter V Invitational alongside Shaquille O'Neal, Lou Piasco, and Reggie Bush. She supported the American Cancer Society in the exhibition. 
In 2018, Eva launched a podcast with her husband called the Natalie Eva Mary Show with the rotating guest list on Podcast One. She explained the idea came from having previously created a YouTube channel where she associationally uploads lifestyle blogs on various subjects and needed a platform to discuss certain topics at more length. They launched a workout program named Fit on her website the following year. In 2019, Eva appeared as a cast member on the second season of the US version of Celebrity Big Brother. In a pair, she was announced as the first ambassador for Monster Energy. Rain Brand was featured in campaign and hosting sponsored event throughout the year. Later the year, she was also signed as an ambassador for Australian fitness and fashion brand Readywear and launched her own Natalie Eva Marine Readywear collection in 2020. Personal Life After dating Jonathan Coyley for a long time, Eva married him in August 2014. Eva considers herself as a sports person and admires that she is a massive San Francisco giant fan. She has admitted that she used to have several alcohol problems, the fact which was also highlighted on her short order divas. Net worth As of December 2021, Eva net worth estimated to be around $3 million plus which she gathered after participating in several wrestling matches and defeating a few tough opponents. She has also done modeling and television shows, although she has worked her way through. She has also appeared in several podcasts for which she received a hefty sum of money. Eva enjoys modeling and fashion design. She has already featured in several movies and her acting career is picking up. Through her career at WWE acting, modeling, and endorsements, Eva has managed to accumulate a net worth of $3 million plus. Thanks to her popularity, Eva will probably enjoy her new acting career and take over the fashion world soon enough. She earns $200K annually as her basic salary from WWE. Eva was recently added back to the WWE roster and the amount is likely to increase as she establishes herself and moves up the ranks. And thank you very much if you are watching our video till now and if you have come for the first time on the channel and you have not subscribed the channel yet then press the subscribe button now and also press the bell icon to see more new videos like this and what do you think about this beautiful fitness model?